I want to share with you a personal story and insight into why I chose street photography. What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name's Jack Coward. I'm a street photographer based in Lincolnshire. This channel then is all about captivating the world of street photography. The ins, the outs, the hustle and bustle of the alleyways and the streets and uncovering the beauty and challenges that forms this art form. So last week then saw me have a catch up with a good old friend of mine and he asked me a question that really got me thinking. Why street photography? Well for that we need to go back a fair few years and it's exactly what that question done. It made me ask myself, it made me reflect. Now back in 2013 I found myself in the heat of Afghanistan on operations with the British Army with whom I served nine years of my life. Over there firefights were inevitable. We had highs, we had lows. I have some fond memories of times with really good friends but little did I know of how much that would turn around and bite me in the rear years to come. Roll on five years later and I was diagnosed with PTSD or post-traumatic stress disorder. My anxiety was through the roof. The fear of going out was real. And the idea of being in an environment that I didn't know with hundreds and thousands of people around me in a crowd of situations just seemed scary and daunting. Now, I decided to use fishing as a way to escape, a way to relieve my head from the voices and everything that was going on and it wasn't until I introduced my very first camera the Canon 200D as soon as I got my hands on that and got out and was taking photos of the fish I was capturing and just moments in time and in life that my love and passion for photography came to the forefront I found that photography served as a a coat of armour, a therapeutic shield, shall we say. It allowed me to unleash this creative vision that was blocked or locked away for some unknown reason. And now it's not just a hobby, it's a way to express my emotions, my thoughts. But most importantly, it's allowed me to capture moments just like this. Now from candid moments to hidden treasures, every click of the shutter opens my eyes to the beauty of everyday life. Embracing the community of other street photographers has also brought on new friendships, new connections and new inspirations. But like anything, street photography isn't without its ups and downs. It requires a delicate balance of respect, empathy, and understanding not only to the subjects that we are photographing but also to us and me that's behind the camera on how I act or react or how I feel on the good days and the bad days but overall street photography has just gave me this whole new sense of purpose and life and it's really allowing me to have a new spark and fulfillment and overall just pure enjoyment again. So as we wrap this video up, I just wanna thank you for taking the time to watch this video. And I know it's something slightly different and I just wanted to give you guys a bit of an insight into me, who I am behind the camera and give a bit of myself to you guys for watching. If you did like it, drop it a thumbs up. Think about dropping a subscribe if you're into street photography. Because you never know, that might aid this video to land on the page of someone who needs it as much as I did all them years ago. Guys, until next time, happy shooting.